you did do the TBT, the basketball tournament, repping the Golden Eagles. And uh, you did pretty well, I would say. You won the the whole thing. Uh, the Golden Eagles are the defending uh, champions of the basketball tournament. And you were part of that in 2020 in July. Uh, Andy and I were talking just before you came on here about how that was like one of the first real American sporting events that got going after the pandemic in that July. A bunch of stuff was announced, but you... It, it was a smaller than usual tournament. It wasn't the normal 64. It was only a 24 team tournament and it was only one venue. Uh, but you still had 24 teams, uh, still televised, and you were the champions of that. Um, TBT is coming up again very soon. So tell us about your experience of the TBT with some of your uh, Marquette compatriots uh, playing for that team. Man, that's uh, the TBT is, is some of the best basketball. Um... You know, a lot of a lot of guys like me get to play. You know, uh, you know, Europe is fun and everything. Uh, you have your fun times, have your bad times, but you know, you playing with a bunch of guys you really don't know. Some of the guys don't care about you. You know, organization don't care about you. Like I said, it's a business at the end of the day. TBT, that's it's straight fun. Like you know, you get to play with. I get to play with guys that I grew up watching, like Trav Diener. You know, guys that uh, guys that that was younger than me, you know, that I didn't get a chance to play with. It's just, you know, all around just great. And then it's great basketball, you know, and um, playing with those guys is just fun. Like I can play with those guys for free and have a great time, you know, but now, you know, playing for money, it makes it even, makes it even more fun. Playing and, for uh, money and money yeah, you won too. Right, right, right. right <laughs> That's right. always nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh, like last year was, was special for us because, um, Going up to that point, you know, each year we got farther in the tournament. I don't know if y'all was keeping up with it. Mm -hmm. We went from, you know, uh, Sweet 16, Elite 8, Final Four, lost in the championship, and won the championship last year. So, you know, it was like it was like a big just, you know, like the monkey off my back pretty much. You know, um, everybody was just excited. Everybody was happy because it's been, you know, f what was it, four years we've been trying to win? So... And we'd be getting closer each year. And, uh, you know, last year was the perfect time. We went right on in the spot that we deserved to go in, you know, to do it with those guys, you know, those guys, you know, a lot of those guys, you know, we like brothers, you know, like a family. It just made it even more special. Coming up, are you going to be on the, on the Golden Eagles team again this year? Or um, Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Are? We already started uh, training for it, our practice. Like we had like a mini camp. So that's the next hurdle. Yeah, last week. Yeah, 64 yeah, teams I'm, this year. It's going to be the big one. So yeah, yeah, we got to be ready. Mm -hmm. For sure, for sure. So how does that actually, in terms of having come off of a championship and everything like that, how does that change your preparation uh, for for this year in terms of essentially being the marked team? Man, we just we doing we turned it up a notch. Like we normally just have one mini camp. We doing like three. <laughs> so uh, everybody is. Uh, Everybody is locked in, everybody on board, and, you know, we pretty much got our same team coming back. So we know we know what it takes. We just got to just be ready, you know, be ready. to Now Now we got to be ready to take that first punch, not give it, you know what I'm saying? So, because everybody, like you said, we're going to be the marked team. Everybody want to beat us. So it's going to be different. And uh, we just got to come harder, come ready. It's too bad you didn't have an experience like that, say in college and say a conference that was notable. Oh yeah, we already covered that. So <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you guys have some some level of experience with that sort of thing. So well prepared. Yeah, yeah. Like like you said, we do we do we do pretty good. The coaches do pretty good at preparing us. Like we watch video, like we take it serious, it's like like a real college game. We watch film, you know, and I think that's what gives us the edge over. A lot, of, a lot of teams, you know, those guys just go in, they just play. But we take it, we take it to a whole nother level. Ohio State is like that. You know, most of the top teams take it serious, you know, and uh, only way you can win. And we play together, you know, we play the Marquette way. Everybody play together, take the best shot. No selfish guys, you know, that's the big thing in this tournament. A lot of, a lot of teams be talented, but selfish, you know, and you can't win in a setting like that if you're selfish, so. Well, good luck to you this year. Yeah, we'll be following along for sure. 